Are you tired of these boring old shirts? Well, introducing <laughs> your new shirt. It says Rise of Phoenix. It's $12. You can buy it at the school store and wear it during Spirit Days. Buy now while supplies last. What's good, Pueblo Academy of Arts? Hi, I'm Molly. And I'm Jasmine. And, and this, this is your Phoenix Vision News for February 3rd. We hope you had a wonderful weekend. Students, remember the Valentine's Day dance is on February 13th. Make sure to not have any Fs or referrals to be able to attend. There's a Safe Sitter Babysitting class this Friday and March 6th at PCC. All students who are interested, go see Ms. Carleo for further information. School Choice is open now through February 9th. If you would like to attend a school outside of your zone, you have to enroll during this time. Your parents have to go through the parent portal on Infinite Campus to enroll you. District Spelling Bee is, is this Wednesday at 6 at Centennial. Our top five qualifiers will go and represent PA. Showcase night went great last week. Thank you to all the Phoenix who helped out. Now let's go over to Haley talking about Showcase night. Hello Phoenix, I'm Haley and today we'll be talking about the Showcase night. At the Showcase night, we had an introduction by Mr. Fadias. We had a Phoenix make a speech on leadership. We had booths on sports and how and all of the classes. Our showcase was to show fifth graders that we are the best school and that they should come here. Thank you. Now back to you, Molly and Jasmine. Thank you, Haley. Students, make sure to follow PA on all social media for morning announcements and reminders. East High School is hosting their eighth grade night this Wednesday from 6.30 to 8. Phoenix, your books are on sale. You can order them in the office for $25. You can also order them online through the PA website. Next week will be Spirit Week. Monday will be Nerd Day. Tuesday will be Jersey Day. Wednesday will be 80s day. And Thursday will be Valentine's shirt day. You must wear khakis all week and each spirit day costs $2. Now let's go over to John interviewing Miss Coletti. Good afternoon, Phoenix. I'm John and today I'm here with Miss Coletti. So welcome back, Miss Coletti. And uh, how's it feel being back at PA? It feels very good to be back. I feel like I've been away from home for a long time and I uh, finally feel like I'm back home. So it feels really good. We're all glad you're back. And uh, can you tell us your experience uh, from being away from PAA? You know, it was, it was sad being away from PAA, but I'm really happy to be back, and I'm excited to see what the future holds with us here at PAA and, and where my career is going to head to next. That sounds wonderful. And uh, what do you plan on teaching now that you're a leadership teacher? I guess leadership things, you know. I guess basically just teaching these sixth graders really just how to be a good person. That's what I hope to teach. That sounds wonderful. Now back to you in the studio. Thank you, John, and welcome back, Ms. Coletti. It's true what they say, once a phoenix, always a phoenix. Now let's see what's up with this week's sports. Hi, I'm Sierra. And I'm Eve. And, and this, this is Phoenix Vision sports. sports. Wrestlers had a wrestling tournament at DHPH on Saturday. Great job to the wrestling team as they defeated ECMS and Brisley. They have a triangular wrestling match tomorrow. Girls basketball varsity B lost. Keep working hard. Girls basketball varsity A won. Good job, girls. You guys are doing great. Girls basketball will have a home game against ECMS on Wednesday. Good luck, girls. Phoenix spring sports are coming fast. Make sure to get your phys physical to participate, please. There will be a fighter to be a runner program on March 7th at the Dutch Clark Stadium. Please participate in, in it. The school with the most kids will get a trophy. Now let's go over to David with our Athlete of the Week. Hi, my name is David, and I'm here with our Athlete of the Week, Roxy. So what sport do you play? I do wrestling. How long have you been wrestling? Uh, like since last year. What's your favorite thing about wrestling? Pinning the person. And what is your record? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Sounds great. Keep working hard. Now back to you in the studio. Thank you, David. That's it for this week. Go, go Phoenix, fire hard, hard, and let's, let's bring on the wind. Now let's go see what's up with this week's weather. Hello there. <laughs> I'm Colby. And for this week's weather, here's the weekly weather joke. Where do snowmen keep their money? In snowbanks. And now it's time for the weather. We start this week with high 46 and low 17. There's a chance of light snow in the day and there will likely be snow in the night. Tuesday the temperature will decrease with a high of 29 and a low of 4. It will be cloudy and cold and there could be snow. Wednesday will have a high of 49 and a low of 15. Wednesday will also be mostly cloudy with, the, with periods of snow at night. Things change on Thursday with a high of 51 and a low of 21. Thursday will be the sunniest day this week with no chance of precipitation. And did you know the speed of typical raindrop, raindrops is 14 miles per hour? This will be a snowy week, so stay safe, have fun, and enjoy the weather. Tune in next week for the weekly weather. Now let's see what's going on with Michael and Gigi with the Rise of Phoenix. Thank you, Colby. 
Hey Phoenix, I'm Gigi. And I'm Michael. And, and this, this is the Rise, Rise of the Phoenix. Phoenix. We hope you're having an amazing day. NAL will have their first playoff match tomorrow against Heaton. It will be at Central in the cafeteria starting at 4.45. Let's see what's up with Brooklyn on this week's Rising Phoenix. Hello, I'm Brooklyn here at this week's Rising Phoenix of the Week, Brooke. So, Brooke, what's your favorite thing about PA? Um, how everybody always tries their hardest and always gives their 100% effort. And what's your goal for this quarter? Um, to get all, a all A's and turn all my stuff in time. And how do you rise? Mm, by getting to school on time and always trying my hardest. Thank you. Now back to the studio. Thank you, Brooklyn, and keep on rising, Brooke. Now let's see what's up with Isaiah. Hello, Phoenix. I'm Isaiah, and I'm here talking to you about the new Spirit shirt. This is it. You could buy it in the school store for 12 bucks. It says, rise up. And Phoenix across this part. Thank you and have a nice day. Thank you, Isaiah. Students, it is important that you get picked up as soon as possible after school. There should be no kids on school grounds after school hours. If you go to the, one of the school's basketball games, remember to be polite and not throw your trash under the bleachers. You can rise this week by turning in your missing work and coming to class on time. The Ronald McDonald House of Charities is still hosting the Pop Tabs fundraiser. Collect Pop Tabs and turn them into your purple first hour. Class with the most pop tabs will be awarded with the pizza party in the fourth quarter from Mr. Farias. With the rise, I'm Michael. And I'm Gigi. Have a good week, Phoenix. Now back to you, Molly and Jasmine. Thank you, Gigi and Michael. Now let's go to lunch with Jamie. Hi, I'm Jamie Pierce, and today I'll be bringing you your lunch menu for this week. Hope you enjoyed the pulled pork and popcorn chicken today. It's Mr. Cleason's favorite. Tomorrow I'll be having mac and cheese. Wednesday will be French toast sticks. Thursday, Fiesta turkey chili. Thursday, pizza is available. Tuesday and Wednesday, spicy chicken. Here's a fun food fact. Pizza Hut used to be the nation's biggest purchaser of kale. Now that's a lot of kale. I'm Jamie, and that's your lunch menu for this week. See you later. Now back to you in the studio. Thank you, Jamie. Sounds delicioso. With Phoenix Vision, I'm Jasmine. And I'm Molly. Have a fabulous, wild, and wonderful week.